Hey, I'm Alex Vu. I'm a junior, and today I will be breaking down Max It Out from D to the end. So the first four measures, you're going to be starting at mezzo forte, and you'll be playing some accented 16 with some taps. Make sure your taps are low to the pad, one inches, three inches, and your accents will be about six inches. Cool. So the first measure, uh, it's going to be a simple rhythm, one you take to two, three you take to four. You're going to have accents on one, beat two, and then the T of three and B4. So um, it'll sound like this. Cool, second measure. Um, you're gonna play the same thing, but you're gonna add a tap eighth note to B2. So measure, uh, measure one and measure two will sound like this. Measure three is going to be kind of similar, but you're going to change a couple accents. Um, the rhythm is going to be one tete to two tete, three tete to four tete. Then you're going to have accents on beat one, beat two, the te of three, and the te of four. So measure three will sound like this. Then you're going to end of the tap, so uh, four tete one. Cool. Fourth measure is going to be a crescendo. One te, two te, te, te three te, 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 four te, up to a four te accent. So it'll sound like this. Cool. Uh, all right, next measure. Um, it's gonna be, so you're now at four te with your accents. Make sure you still got low taps. Uh, the rhythm is gonna be one te, 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 two te, te, three te, 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 four. And you're gonna have accents on beat one, beat two, the T of three, and beat four. And you're gonna play it two times in a row. Cool. Uh, the next measure is going to be all 16 counts. You're gonna have accents on beat one and beat three. And then you're gonna have buzzes on two te and T ta of four. So it'll go one T te ta buzz te buzz te. <laughs> Ooh. One, one T theta buzz buzz one T theta buzz buzz. It's gonna sound like this. And then you end with an accent. Cool. Next measure is one T theta two T theta buzz four. So it'll be accents on one and two, and then you um, buzz sixteen skeleton three T theta, and then release note on four. Uh, this next measure, you're going to jump up to fortissimo with accents. So you put a little arm in there. They're going to be one te, two, three te, four with flams. So it'll go right, 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 left, left, left. Then you're going to release with a rim shot. Now remember here that your um, the lower note of the flam is going to be one inch and keep it very low controlled, and then remember you bring arms up for the accented fortissimo. Cool. Uh, the next measure is going to be the same rhythm, one, two, three, two, four, with accents, just right, 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 left, left, left. Um, rim shots, they're gonna be rim shots. Then you're gonna end with an accented piano. Um, and then after that, uh, your next, Actually, the, the rest of the uh, thing is going to be all 16th notes. You're gonna vary up your accents. So the first measure, it's at piano. Uh, you're gonna have a little raised accent, maybe three or four inches, and then your taps are three inches. So it's gonna go one tita, two tita, three tita, four tita, accents on one and three. Next measure is going to be just accenting all the downbeats. You're going to end of the tap, and then you're going to have a full four, four beat crescendo of 16th notes to an uh, accented fortissimo release. Cool. All right, uh, let's play the piano 16th to the end to get the matching note. One, two, ready, go. Mm. C 
see uh, as an example right there, make sure you're staying with the metronome. Don't get too ahead of yourself. Yes, they're 16ths. Yes, they're fast rhythms, but it does not mean you would play faster than the metronome. So that's my bad. We'll try again. One, two, ready, go. to measure 33 with the starting of the forte 16th accent stuff. back up to D and we're gonna do the whole thing. the whole chop. Um, keep in mind, make sure your taps are always low, always consistent, and even. And even when you throw in the different accents, different heights, make sure that part is what it doesn't change. Um, all right. All right. Let's try it at 132. 